Good morning, YouTube. Looks like we are live. I'm Mag Synchro with Convertible Turtle Gaming. It is just a little bit after 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time today, Monday, July the 3rd, which means one day before the 4th. And it's time for some more Legend of Zelda Breakfast of the Wild. Also known as the subtitle right now, The Adventures of Korok Man. Skylar Cupo Earl and Roblox Gamer, good morning to both of you. Thanks for joining the chat earlier. Dragon Slays, Chad Keller, hey guys. Catwater, uh, Braz W11, welcome to the chat, man. And we're going to go back to some more Korok Foreman. Hey, Matt Rayford. And good morning, Fox T from Madrid. How is it going, guys? How is it going? Zekrov1. Morning. Am I always late to streams? Uh, not always. I'm usually a lot early, but today I just, you know, showed up a minute late. It's kind of like everybody else, you know, we, we sort of start when we start. We got a, a suggestion. It's, you know, it's fashionably late. That's a way to look at it. All right. Let's see here. Where did we leave our trusty steed breakfast at? Breakfast is down there somewhere. Yeah, exactly, man. A minute. A minute. So we got all these that were down over here. If I recall, we were going to start looking over here at the Gachini Plain. I think that's what the, uh, the plan was when we found this Korok seed over here. So there's not really a... An easy portal, but I think this is going to be our best bet. Oh, Catwater. Rip. Congratulations, Matt Rayford, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, dude. Uh, you've been here long enough. I think we've got a very similar light, line set. Um, I think you deserve it, dude. I really do. You've never said a crossword. I've, I've, you've always been right there with the chat. I think you earned it, man. Uh, are we doing spoilers or no spoilers? Uh, spoilers are fine for this part, man. We've uh, there's no reason not to do any kind of spoilers for this because this is just regular stuff. We were just trying to be non-spoilers for all the hunting stuff we was doing the other day because it was brand spanking new. Oh, what's that? An iron shroom. We'll pick up an iron shroom. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We would definitely like some arrows, Beetle, because Beetle's wow. awesome and Korok Man needs arrows. Yay. Hey, Alexander Tamaim, welcome to the chat, man. <laughs> I don't think we need even bugs. Let's get us a, a mount oh. here. Take the horse. We'll take out breakfast, because we're not sure where poor old breakfast is left at, but we got him up now. All right. Oh, yeah. Okay, so... We're going to start just up on this trail... And just kind of filter into here, I think, is where we're going to be at. Hey, Jackson. 
Um, what's fake, Jelson? Yeah, you can get arrows cheaper at Kakarito, man, but I shop local. I shop Beetle. Um, rubber armor, I've got some pieces of it. More Korok hunting, dragon. Tomorrow's gonna be the 12 hour trial of the Master Sword. That's what we're doing tomorrow. But we're to that point to where we gotta do some Korok seed hunting and some monster killing so we can get some armor and stuff upgraded. A couple on the ridge south of me. Well, that sounds like a real good place for Korok Man to start his pursuit of justice. Oh, awesome, Fox T. Way cool. Always loved summer vacation when I was younger. It was one of those things I always looked forward to. It just uh, never dawned on me when I was younger that that was a, a young thing and not an old fart thing like, you know, now. I don't know what that was, but I, I hear the I hear the cry of a Korok coming up though. There's a there's a cow over here. Uh, the four old Korok man suit. It's actually uh, Tingle, and it is the Korok thing so it's like the tingle pants the tingle shirt and the korok mask so so it's uh there's actually quests that you get given oh man fox t that's pretty cool um bad respect for you though i've got a cousin who's a teacher and a friend who's a teacher and another friend who's a a vice principal um <laughs> you are you are far too uh humble for what you do man Good morning, 604 Kings. So there's supposed to be two up on this ridge. We got the first one. Next to me is west of me by a giant statue. Alright, so there's a giant statue over here. Alright. Ooh, bananas. Going bananas, guys. Going bananas. Well, that lizard even knows that things are about to go south over here, so let's see. Hello, Korobacoblin. Korokman says hello. Right now, Korok Man is kind of going through and sniping you all like Solid Snake. Hey, I'll cool you off, dude. Applied to that, we'll go ahead and put you in a timeout, and then when you figure out what you got going on, you can know what it is. Yeah, I know, Dragon. I can buy a lot more stuff from everybody, but it requires rupees, and we're kind of rupee poor. That's okay. Korok Man can find rupees pretty good. Um, once we get to a good place where there's some clumps of them, we can really earn them real quick. Wow, there's two treasure chests over here. Maybe we'll find something that Korok Man can pawn. Thanks for that shadow, really appreciate it, sir. Uh, we don't need the spear. Does Korok Man need a photo? Oh, he does too. Oh man, that's that's a shame. That's my kind of my fear is we're gonna be doing all this Korok seed hunting and we're gonna get down to like one or two. Oh, 
Can't do that. Hmm. Come on, the fire needs to spread. Not doing that. Uh, yeah, Dragon Slayer, but do you really want to sit and watch me play bowling for an hour? I mean, be honest, man. I know some people are fans of bowling, but I'm not one of them to that point. Yeah, Magnesis could have worked. That was something I, I hadn't thought of. Hmm. Oh, I got a twig. <laughs> I'm like, what can I drop? What can I drop? But that's not the point of this thing, my dragon. This is all on cam. Everything you guys see before here is on camera. That's true. I mean, we, we don't have enough to go on like a supermarket shopping spree or something, but we get far enough rupees and gemstones and everything else just from exploring that we will have no to little problem of getting certain things. Alright, there we go. We pop some choo choos. Still looking for a statue. Haven't found it yet. Found a lot of bananas. Found some treasure chests. Up the cliff. That's where we're going. Yeah, Warren Korok seed, man. That's that's rough. Uh, Rivali's Gale is now ready. Yeah, I don't think I need to farm ancient stuff. Um, I don't know, 604 Kings. We don't know, like, any details in the next DLC, so it's kind of hard to guess. Um, I'm hopeful it'll be equal. So, Bo, Isaac Stevens! Yeah, that works too, Catwater, I think. Just... I, I don't always hit every single ore vein, though, because... Either I'm lazy, which is predominantly the reason one, or it's the, uh... Oh! Korok man hears the distress call of one of his brethren! What are we doing over here, peoples? What are we doing? Oh, we got something to donate, it looks like. Hmm... Usually these donation quests have whatever we want to donate real handy. So we're going to say it's either bananas or a mighty thistle. So let's go ahead and hold the mighty thistle and hold the banana. And we'll just put them both here. Maybe not. Maybe if I actually get them on the banana this time. Okay, so maybe just the mighty banana. Huh. Um, it's that possible to get the much health and stamina, man. A hearty durian. I probably do. Yep, I got a hearty durian. Thanks for that, Matt. Aha, aha. 
Hey, Agnes! That was kind of my second thought. Kind of my second thought. Alright. Oh, there's some durians over here. We'll grab some of them while we're up and about. So these little squatty trees like that. Yeah, we'll go grab some durians over there. Because I know I want those some point as well. They cook pretty decent. Yes, Yagnash. Matt is a mod now. We had some openings for mods. And he became a mod. Hey, Michael Kennedy. Good morning, sir. Yep, Jackson RF. You got it, man. 100% is 100%. All right, and Korok Man is back to his trusty Steve Breakfast. And he spies a civilian selling things. Go any direction and she'd walk into one. Okay. Let's see what he has to sell, guys. Nothing we can't get on our own. Alright. I think we want to turn around here. Have you ride the LOM? I have no clue what the LOM is yet. Hey, Street Urchin, welcome back. Uh, I have plenty of hardy deer in Ag Agnesh. I got seven of them. There's no reason for me to buy any more, I don't think. Oh. Korok man helps everybody. Not just the Koroks. He's here for all of Hyrule. You, sir, with the weird tats and face paint. You shall die, too. And being very, very much electricity afraid, Korok man turns into... Wooden weapon dude only. Speaking of which, sounds good. <laughs> you okay, lady? Oh. Korok farming, man. Um, how do you get the horse gear? Uh, don't know what you're talking about, man. Uh, Lord of the Mountain, though, we've not managed to go back to Lord of the Mountain yet. He's kind of on our to-do list, and we just have not got to him to, to do him yet. Right, and you, sir. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Those two. I think they're the same ones I've saved in other spots before, so figure that out. Um, not sure, man. I'll have to, to look into that at some point. I know I've got the uh, the royal bridle. That kind of counts, right? Oh, horsey. I would like to very much go down there, but I guess breakfast doesn't want to go down there at all. Hmm. Oh well. Oh, you're fine, Alex. Yeah, I like the new horse too, but breakfast is going to have to sit this one out for a bit while we go walk up there. Because breakfast doesn't want to come down here, and we don't have the time to try to maneuver breakfast. I don't know, Isaac. Hey, Demon Huntress. Good morning.
Yeah, we've not explored anything over here, so... We're gonna drop some exploration pins. Which will force us to... Go just about everywhere. Uh, Yagdash, for sure cliffs, that ain't gonna work. Um, I really don't know, Matt. I've... I'm not really familiar with all the armor that's available. I gotta say the classic Ocarina of Time stuff would be kind of cool. That's about it. Alright, that's all that. Got some more horses over here. Got a squirrel. Up. Yeah, I'm doing pretty well, man. Uh, nowhere near where we want to be with the Korok seeds, though. Now here's a nice little bomb spot. You know what would have been really cool to add in this game? The door repair charge guy from the original Zelda. If, if you played the original Zelda, you know what I'm talking about. The guy who you basically you set fire to the leaves or the rocks or whatever seems to be a natural, oh, there's something behind there moment. And when you get in, the guy's like, you've destroyed my door, you got to pay me for the repair. Um, a hundred and something, Street Urchin. Got a hundred and something. All right, we got some heads shaking. We're gonna guess first that it requires us to be at the top of this structure because it's, my God, tall. Koroks like to hide in tall places. They like to hide under things. They like to hide in things. They like to run around invisible. Koroks are, uh, Koroks are kind of cool. Speed trial, oh. Speed trial, yuck. So, uh, for those of you watching today, my name is Max Synchro. I'm with Convertible Turtle Gaming, and that's myself and Digrat, my wife. And I stream Breath of the Wild every morning, every morning at a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Usually when I come home from work, and when I get home from work. I basically play for an hour and then I go to bed. Today though is a buffet stream. So um has wait what? Yeah, thirty four watching, thirty seven watching, yeah man. It's not too bad of a speed trial. Yeah. Hey, Austin Gaming. Welcome to the stream, man. Uh, Dragon Slays, I am over here. Near Heron Lake on, uh... Guccini Plain. Alright, so... We came... well, we know where exactly where we came from. We came from that way. So, we just want to... go back that way so we can keep looking at... Uh, I naturally get to be off for the work for the fourth. Um, my, my shift that I usually work is... Wednesday night through Saturday night, so that Tuesday I happen to be off, and because it's going to be such a long stream, we chose the 4th because we figured we'd get a lot of people to watch, um, people were really excited about it when we, we announced it as a possibility, and I'm off Wednesday because I don't work on the holiday and my company is real cool um, about that kind of stuff. Yagnash, you keep, you keep subbing, man. Thanks for it, but... Yeah. 
All right. Wait, what? Looks like somebody. Oh, it's an Octorok. I gotta get better at doing that to Octorox guys. I've seen some people try the, the Trial of the Master Sword. Thanks for super him? What? Um, I'm not sure what you're talking about, Alex, but you're welcome. <laughs> if, I, if I did something you like, you're, you're absolutely welcome. Oh, what? Did I, did my spear break? No, my spear didn't break. Okay. That was weird. Oh, my other sword broke. Sad. Uh, have I played Breath of the Nest? No Roblox Gamer. I've not played Breath of the Nest. It looks really fantastic, though. I mean, it's one of those games that I might play after this one, just for a little bit, to kind of tie it all together. And yeah, Austin, we're, we're collecting Koroks, just like the uh, stream title description kind of suggests. We got so many Koroks left to go. Uh, no, Isaac, we aren't. We are not. <laughs> um, I am not a good enough player for the hard mode, master mode. But when we finish normal mode, we're going to try to do a three heart run um, on master mode. Yes, Dragon Slayers, we found all but the one in Hyrule Castle. And that's the way this playthrough is going, is we don't go into Hyrule Castle until we get everything else done. Yeah, what Matt said. Come on. Man, the fact that their corpses can actually electrify you is kind of frustrating. I, I've heard Master Mode is uh, sufficiently challenging. Who threw that? Who threw that? Armin Oosten just subscribed. Thanks for the subscription, man. Really appreciate that, Armin. Yep, I do. It's in the Hyrule Castle. And that's the reason why we don't have the shield, because we're not going in the Hyrule Castle. Yeah, Korok's protection, man. You can't beat a Korok, man. Korok, secret liberator of all... Korok man, secret liberator of all the Koroks everywhere and hunter of treasure. Since I can find this treasure chest. A phrenic bow. Interesting. Seems to seem to indicate that bullet time is the way to go with that. Test that out real quick. Oh wow, I like that. Okay, that's cool. Yeah, that's that's really cool. I like that. It'll be really good for all this Korok hunting we're doing, guys. Body until they poof. 
got to keep that in mind. Can't touch their bodies until they poop. Come on. Man, I got to get that timing down better. Uh, well, Austin Gaming, we're, we're currently hunting through this area, man. Uh, it, it, if you currently are without audio, um, I recommend turning it on so we can communicate. Okay, this... We've, have we have already been here? Yeah, we were already there. No, we haven't gotten there, but, but the mask isn't freaking out, so okay. So I think we can delete the green pin safely. Alright, we'll head toward the blue one now. See what we can get. We got some basketball over here. So we got that guy down. We got one more over here. Well, Eric, uh, we try not to do any kind of exploits, and save scumming, as, uh, as helpful as it is, that's pretty much an exploit, dude. So, appreciate you recommending it, because I understand that's the way some people play, but it's not the way we do things. There's another Korok seed. Looks like it's going to be right in here. Up, up and away! This Korok's about to be smashed. There's just no helping it. Uh, Korok Forest is... Roblox, I think you've asked for that before, man. Korok Forest is all the way over here. It's north of Hyrule Castle. There's lots of hints in the game that tell you where it is. I recommend really exploring to find it. Hey Abby! Welcome to the stream! I'm always trying to figure out weird ways to do stuff, and the Cronus thing is kind of the way that I can help improve my basketball shot, so I, I think it's the Zelda equivalent of the granny throw. That's okay, Roblox. A lot of people don't remember asking stuff before, especially if they don't remember the answer, or if they slept, or any number of things. Oh, you, sir. Derek got you that time. Time to deliver a pizza ball. Do you post your hero path on Reddit CTV? No, I haven't, man. Uh, probably when I finish, I might, though. Go to the east to the bridge for some Koroks. Alright. 
So we're gonna go that way anyways, because we got this golden pin and pink pin. So to the golden pin we go. Yeah, we're just doing some Korok hunting, Abby. You're you're allowed to help with that. The the no spoiler thing was just for the new DLC because that was something that had just come out, and I was trying to actually find it on my own. That's kind of funny. It shield just bounces it right there. How come I sleep after I stream? Because I work nights. I uh, I work nights, so you know, I gotta go to bed. It's kind of like asking people how come you go to bed before you go to bed. Uh, yes, I've seen people fight Golden Lionels before time to deliver pizza. I'm not looking for them, but I know they exist. Leave that pin, and we'll start heading toward this bridge. Alright, see you, Alex. I know you have a job now. Congratulations on the job, man. Getting employment's one of those difficult things. Oh, you silly, silly, silly Korok. Deflate you little, little sand octo. What are you doing out in the middle of nowhere? Alright, and we come down here. All right. We heard her. Yeah, I don't expect them to see many of them on normal mode in my Agnash. Oh, that's cool. I don't know, mythical man. When we, when we uh when we teleport, we will know. All right, so... so... She's like right around here somewhere. Hidden balloon to shoot in a flower trail. Okay. Uh, 900 total, Roblox Gamer. Uh, Yagnish, Matt's got um, 900 of them. Alright, so there's a flower. There's another flower. Uh, I don't like where this flower is trying to get me, guys. Flyer was trying to drown me. Of course that flyer went up the wall. Sure, don't you know it's raining, flower? Don't you know it's raining? Oh, that's cool, Demon Huntress. Oh, cool! Girls get jealous. Awesome. That happens sometimes, Roblox. Alright, so we got the little one there. I was told that there would be shooting balloons somewhere, possibly. Oh, wait, what? There's the sun for what it's worth. Hmm. Uh, yeah, test, test. Cool. So you got less than, than uh, Matt, is what you're saying, Yagnash.
morning, Charles. 236. Wow, Sally. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, Matt's got the most. The game gave up after Matt found all the ones he found. Decided it had enough of somebody trying to find all the cork seeds. Um... Yeah, so Digrat's wanting to start streaming again. Um, she's been wanting to do Zelda, uh, Skyrim. Wrong button. Come on, Mag. <laughs> Wake up a little bit more. But the thing is, is when we got the green screen set up and everything, it kind of rearranged our living room to where she can't stream Skyrim at all. I mean, it involves way too much stuff being moved around. And so she's going to need a computer similar to mine, set up kind of similar to mine. Uh, a lot of people said that they love to watch Skyrim, and she likes playing it. Now, her her streaming would not be as family friendly as me streaming because I I love Digrat, uh, but her uh, vocabulary and mine are very dissimilar at times. Oh, that sounded like a oh yep, that's a banana minion. Bananas and the rupees. Uh, favorite Sonic character is Knuckles. Knuckles is my favorite character out of the Sonic universe. I gotta admit, Rouge is kind of cool though. Hey, Mohammed, welcome. All right, sorry about that, dude, Jackson. Um. <laughs> oh, we uh, we have an understanding, but so it, it'll be. I'm I'm looking forward to it. She she always entertains me when she plays Skyrim, so I think she'll entertain you guys too. All right, where is this Korok over here? Korok man's powers seem to be failing us, guys. I hear the scream. See you, Agnesh. The balloon may be in a leafy area. Hint, hint. Well, they're all leafy areas. Why are your hints so cryptic and vague? Uh, no, the Sheikah sensor does not detect Koroks. The Korok mask does. And that is Korok Man's sonic superpower. See, Korok Man. Superhero extraordinaire with a wooden shield that we never got a photo of. So, wooden shield. Hey guys, in today's buffet stream, uh, something to keep up in mind on that was the fact that at 9 o'clock we're going to add the likes. Oh, Demon Huntress just donated $2. Thank you for that, Demon Huntress. That is, that is super awesome. Oh my god. Yeah, guys, get some hashtag Demon Huntress in there. Really appreciate that. That'll that helps us. We're going to uh, we unfortunately the the donation goal doesn't add up to that stuff. But yeah. Oh man. Okay, uh, that's way cool, way cool. But we will uh, definitely get that put in there real quick. Anytime you guys see any kind of... Uh, if you're in the Discord, that's another thing, is the tips and the ad revenue that we get from the stream is all documented in there, so you know pretty much what we got coming in and what's going out, because we want to be transparent to our actual fan base as to what's coming up and down the pipe. 
the uh, one thing also to keep in mind though is that Uncle Sam gets his cut and a few other people get their cut so when it's all said and done we, we want to make sure that you know that what you got's coming is coming but what's not uh that's okay Roblox I mean you don't have to mics are the same as the people watching that's always awesome that's always awesome yep they take 30 percent of the the YouTube for super chat and that's fine they uh they are dealing with all the hassle of credit card debt um, that I don't have to deal with, so I have no problem with that money going that way. Alright, so we got these two. We got that one. I still feel like Korak Man says that there's a Korak behind us this way. So we're gonna, we're gonna see if we can find one this direction. It's absolutely appreciated. Oh, there you go, Jackson. Whoa. I, I had never, like, run through a brick like that before. That was kind of cool. Ouch. All right. Oh, and it missed him. There we go. That time I got him. No Koroks? That's okay, Abby. That's okay. There's, you know, you guys just showing up and saying hey and joining chat. That's 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 plenty. I mean, if you want to donate a little bit for Super Chat or if you want to donate a little Streamlabs or PayPal or anything, that's great too. Um, if you want to donate artwork for the channel. You know, maybe you're maybe you're a starving artist. If you're a starving artist, you know that's the way it happens. Okay, that's the Korok that we'd already found. Okay, we get that. You know, can get the treasure. LOL. Um. Oh, Jackson. Uh, if it's nah, man. The, the, the amount of ad revenue I would get from you watching is not worth it if you're just wanting to try to donate <laughs> through ad revenue. Hey, Stacy C. Good morning. Um, all right. So, there's nothing over in here, according to Matt Rayford. We got a little Korok seed there. Let's, uh... All right. So, I believe I was informed that there's Korok seeds down this way, though. So we are going to reunite with breakfast and see if we can go get some wild stuff going on. Unknown Lost Souls, good morning, welcome to the chat. And uh, is there another way to donate? Well, you can donate time, which all of you do when you come in. You donate time. Uh, you, you sit down, you say hi to me. You, you know, that's precious to everybody, is the amount of time they have in their life. Uh, so I'm not discounting that at all, guys. Uh, you can donate channel art. Um, I've been working on... Uh, I think it's tips, Shadow. It's tips uh, for the, the actual donation information. Oh, whoa! You could do You turned my own horse against me. How dare you do that? Zelda fan just subscribed. Thanks for the subscription, Zelda fan. Alright. Let's, let's see if. Well, it looks like the horse is going to go down a sheer cliff. Wow. Can't get the horse to get on a raft. Can't get him to go down an ice block. But sheer cliff? Sure, nothing. Nothing to it for that. Alright. Oh, well, yeah. Cool, man. Yeah, it's morning for me, so I, I usually say good morning to people. What's funny, though, is I'm, I'm an overnight employee. So it's getting close to, to night for me. I usually go to bed at 9 o'clock. But... This is a buffet stream. So at 9, we're going to count the number of watchers and the number of likes. And we are going to 
to total all that up and determine how much longer we go. Uh, we will be determining that in a little bit. Hey, Jackson, appreciate it, man. I got mods that do that for me, though. Um, yeah, absolutely hit the like button. Uh, in another nine minutes, nine minutes, guys, we'll be totaling up. I saw some, I saw some Korok trail coming off me. There we go. There we go. But yeah, we uh we add up all the actual core. We actually. Oh, I'm from the southeastern United States, Unknown Lost Souls. So specifically the Atlanta, Georgia area. Master Swords running low on energy. We will hit you with the Master Sword. I'm going to blow up. Alright. So now we're back to the trusty Tri-Fork Boomerang, because that always helps. Get some roasted foods. We don't need any of those Boko Spears. Oh! You just let your buddy die. Is that the way it works for you guys? more than one of you. How quaint. That usually gets a Nervosa's Fury out of me. If you ambush me, there's more than one of you. I've gone past a few Korhawks. Oh, shiny object syndrome, even over here. Alright. Turn around, get some of this stuff. Go back toward where we think the Koroks are. Boomerangs are pretty neat. Uh, they, they take a bit to get used to, that's for certain. Oh, oh, wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Don't forget the chests. Um, yeah, there are chests over here, aren't there? Guess I should grab those. These might have something important into them. Crazy Monkey Fire Girl 106 Gaming just subscribed. Thanks for the subscription, Crazy Monkey Fire Girl 06 Gaming. Boy, that's a name. That's a name and a half. Up, 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 up. Let's see here and break them all open. Well, wasn't expecting that to come out of there, but hey. It's actually now that we got that kind of balance there and three of it there and we realize we can't break it that way, we'll just we'll just use our skeleton key on it, shall we guys? What's with the zombie? When people subscribe the zombie pops up. And it is completely out of character for this particular game. And so it stands out. You know, that that's something we try to do, is when we're playing, we want our subs to be there. Um, yeah, I kind of was too, Eric Peterson. That the, the boomerang, while cool, is not as cool as it used to be. Oh, that's a cool idea. I didn't even think about that. Magnesis on the metal boomerang? Alright, get some more foods. Set this down. Run away! Oh yeah, the mask is awesome. I, I found like 40 Korok seeds in yesterday's stream because of this mask. It, uh... The Rook's protection is it's now ready definitely to roll. worth the DLC in my opinion. Uh, 
And uh, as far as America's Got Talent, I don't watch it, so... So I missed some Korok seeds over here, I was told. See where we find them. Yeah, I mostly use boomerangs like a sword. Occasionally I'll throw them. Yes, they do. If you'll read my description, though, you'll see exactly why I'm able to do what I can do. I'm part of what's called the YouTube Content Creators Club. Any YouTube video that I upload that is content copyright protected, I actually just inform Nintendo about it. They review the video, make sure it matches their standards, and then I get a cut of the revenue. One by the cliff and one out by the out spit of the beach. Wait, I don't know what that means, but that's fine. And we'll throw that one. Korok man. Up, up, and away. I see a Korok just from right over here. I can tell that that's going to be an OCD Korok puzzle. Da, da, da. Hey, Raiden, welcome back, man. Yeah, I got the idea, man. I got the idea. I wasn't 100% on board until I saw the area, and then it was. Yeah, ha I found you. That's right. Rock seed. We got 19 of them. There might be a talus behind me. Might be a talus behind me. Okay. That might be a talus. You're absolutely correct. You know what, guys? Oh. Uh... Palace in the rain, this is not going to go good, but we're going to do what we can. Uh. Alright, he's going to have to go down. I'm not going to have to stay down, though, apparently. Ugh. God, in the rain is just so not good for us. Um... Ouch. Yeah, we will be checking the, the counts in just a second, Yagnesh. <laughs> awesome, guys. Awesome. Come on, throw that rock. Alright, come on, go down, Mr. Talus. Ah, oh, we missed. Missing's bad. Danger, Will Robinson, danger. Can't, we can't keep doing that. Especially tomorrow. I know we have taluses we gotta fight tomorrow. Fighting this thing in the rain was not the brightest thing I've done. And running right up to that amber piece was definitely the second most dumbest thing I've done today. Alright, come on. Go down to the next arm.
Come on down. Come on down. You know you want to come down. Ah, come on. Hold that, Tal. Let's hold that. Oh. Yeah. There we go. Just about got him beaten. Ah. About beat herself that way. About to beat herself that way. electric arrows that's good so if that becomes the only method I have inside the travel master sword tomorrow I know I can at least do it uh, we had some timeouts going on what 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 okay all right guys so we got 46 viewers right now and now we're going to YouTube to see what the official like count on the video is according to YouTube we got 49 likes 46 viewers uh, I know we had 51 during the actual Talus fight, so what we'll do is we'll make it an easy 100. So that means that this stream gets 100 extra minutes, and with the 100 extra minutes, that means we get an hour and 40 minutes, so we are going until 10.40 p.m. That's today's stream. That's all because of you guys. Give me just one moment. I'm setting the official timer that I got over here. Ten forty, we got it set, and we're good to go. Um, well, Demon Huntress, did you read the rules? Because if you don't read the rules, um, then you're not going to be able to send messages. And yeah, you, uh, you you only get a certain amount of time to agree to the terms. It's basically to stop people from spamming the system. Um, and then it boots you from the server. So, it looks like you got booted from the server. So, you'll have to rejoin. Alright. We try to keep a family-friendly server. Um, yeah, you only get a certain amount of time to type that in. Yeah, I believe it's like um, 10 minutes or 3 minutes. I'm trying to remember which. Uh, but try to rejoin it again. I've reset your permissions, so it'll actually no longer have you muted. Let's see here. Doo -doo -doo. Yeah, thanks for throwing the, the Discord up there. Alright. So we got that, we got the Talus, we got the Korok Seeds, we got the extra bonus time, and now we're going toward breakfast. I hope breakfast away. Oh, uh, United States, Patrick. I'm in the US. I'm in the state of Georgia in the Atlanta metro. Hey, Ponas, I'm so sorry. I, I see people saying you in the chat. I was looking for things that you were saying so I could respond and it wasn't seen here. Um, if you just go back to join it again, Demoness, it, or Demon Huntress, you should be fine. I, I reset your permissions, so you should be able to go in and try to rejoin again. Actually, I think we need to go the other way anyways. For their speech. So the horse keeps trying to knock Korok Man off. It doesn't work that well. All right. 
I don't know, opponents. I haven't had to fast travel yet, so that's usually how I go to check. Urbosa's fury is ready. You might stick around? Um, uh, I think I've gotten about 18 today. Uh, Georgia is in the southeastern part. If you're familiar with Florida, Georgia is the state just north of Florida. I, I think just about everybody knows where Florida is, thanks to television. I, I see you, Demon Huntress, now. And just the dot agree. Hey, there you go. You got it. You got it. Okay, Roblox Gamer. Thanks for coming in, man. Really appreciate you. Hoping for some Korok loving over here, but I guess none. Uh, you know what? <laughs> I, I bet I still have that poor side quest over here. Cheap rustlers. No, I guess not. Uh, still says unauthorized to send messages. Um. No, you should have it now. Oh yeah, you got it. I see it. Yeah, we try to keep our chat just as safe as we try to keep our actual YouTube guys. Uh, yeah, me and Breakfast are getting along for the most part. Sometimes Breakfast doesn't settle well and we gotta do some weird things with Breakfast, but you know, that's, that's kind of Breakfast for everybody, right? Oh, that would have been such a great picture of that if I would have thought about getting the picture faster. Oh well. So hopefully we'll find some, some actual chests and some Koroks around here. We're looking. Uh, Matt Rayford, uh, are you posting it in the rules page? That's the only page they can post when they first join that. So... And it, the actual default dumps them in the rules page, so they it should allow that. Oh, thanks for the subscription, Mr. Spear, or Mrs. Spear. I'm not sure what that gender the, the name is, and I don't know how to pronounce it, so I try to use honorifics typically. So far, I've not seen the Korok mask do its thing yet. Oh, wow. Well, you guys got hit by Choo Choo Fury. That's some impressive Fury. And double electricity for the price of one. Gotta love that. Oh, well, that's okay. No problem with that at all, Matt. No problem with that at all. Oh, that's a falsy. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's real. Yeah, it is real. Interesting. Did that work? Oh, and we dropped the edge anyways. Open the chest and see what's inside. None for a short while on the beach. Ah, uh, okay. All right. I, I I used to be a Discord noob. I'm a I'm still. There's a lot of things in Discord I don't get. Um, I I definitely see the appeal for it though because you can use it in the browser on your phone, on a PC. Um, so it makes it really, really just flexible for any kind of game chat needs. 
Well, I guess it depends upon who's pointing the weapon at him. I mean, if a horse trusts you and you point a weapon at it, it has no reason not to have any problems with that. Yeah, I'm I'm usually more concerned about killing my horse than anything, too. So, I'm willing to bet that this whole entire stretch of the beach right here on the south side doesn't have anything. So let's go ahead and turn on the path. Well, we're still in unexplored territory, so that's... Wow, that's a cluster of everything, isn't it? Okay. <laughs> so at least we're in unexplored, uh, un unexplored territory, so yeah. Um, horse God's usually not happy with you when you get the horses dead. You're absolutely right on that, Sue. <laughs> if someone points a weapon at you, you're going to run regardless if you trust them or not. That's probably the smart thing to do. Probably the smart thing to do. Alright, Lorelin Village. Okay, now I'm beginning to see why we have so much coverage over here, because this is where that crazy... crazy uh, stuff kind of happened with the Koroks at one time. Oh no, a Bruner! It's a new part of the DLC, man. Yeah, absolutely. I can see where I was doing the hardest Korok. I mean, oh my gosh. Over here, when I kept hitting that rock everywhere, just, oh my gosh. That that was just nuts. But yeah, you can see, uh, okay, see you, cat. But yeah, it makes it so much easier so you can tell exactly where you're you're looking for stuff. Oh. Korok man, here's the distress call of yet another Korok. And this one left some breadcrumbs. Maybe. There we go. I just missed it there. Yeah, uh, we actually managed to do the boathouse one with octo balloons. I. I forget which one of you guys finally suggested to do octo balloons, but that made it so much easier than what we were doing. Oh my gosh, it was insanely easy at that point. There's the leaf. It's back over this way. But yeah, we put some octo rock balloons on it and used the. Uh... Yeah, oh, Chad, it was you. I thought it was. I couldn't remember if it was you or Scott Glenn, Chad. Um, I, I remember you both kind of joined about the same time. Yeah, Chad's been here for a while. You can cut the palm left of the house and then stasis it and run up carrying the rock. Um, that sounds like a really, really awesome way to fix it. But that wasn't the way I went about it. I, uh, I, I played, uh, I, I seriously played some Chase the Rock for a while. And then finally managed to octa balloon it up. Alright, so... What are we looking at over here, Matt? Yeah, I, I it's all a Chad's completely about that. Um, that was that was totally him. I kind of feel like there should be some more Koroks over in this little range over here. So I think I'm gonna go through and get my pins going. Missed one in the village. Oh well, shoot. We're going to go and uh, go back to the village. We're going to do the lazy man way so we can see the Korok count. Uh, not so much because I'm lazy. That, that's part of it. But so I can see the actual Korok count as well, guys. Uh, we're up to 112. So we've gained 12 this stream.
shoot an apple growing on a palm. That's probably the one. Look for a piece of fruit out of place. Looks like that's about what we're dealing with it then. So... Shoot an apple growing out of palm. So you know what I think I'm going to do? I think I'm going to do this a little smart. I think... We're going to Sheikah Sensor the apple. Derby Shark, yeah, man, I remember you, man. Oh, thanks, Pro Gaming. Thanks. Uh, clues make it kind of fun. Um, if you got, you know, there there is a point. Let, let's let's be honest. There is a threshold where if you've given me clues, and you've given me clues, and then 20 minutes later we're still on the same clues, it's probably within everybody's best interest to go, Mag, open up your map, put down some pins, and let's tell you where this is. Um, but yeah, clues make it more fun for everybody involved. Come on, puppy. Eat up. Or not. Aren't you hungry, puppy? I know I'm hungry. I'm taking a real quick snack break while this dog eats. Possibility I already got the chest, but if I do, I'm going to actually put the chest icon down this time, so I'm not not go. Yeah, he's he's definitely uh, he's just in it for the food. All right, so now we can definitely put down. The chest sticker to let us know that we got the dog here. All right, seems good that way. Yeah, those doggies get greedy. Yeah, I saw that derpy shark. I've, I've, we've been getting some subs. In honor of us having a thousand subs, tomorrow we're doing a 12-hour stream. And we're going to do the Trial of the Master Sword starting at 8 o'clock in the morning and going until 8 p.m. That's 12 hours of good old mag death count goodness, guys. Sava, sava. That's awesome, Matt. Um, wherever I need to use it, uh, pizza. I am on vacation, sure. Hmm. Oh, we've already been to Eventide Island, so no worries there. Alright, so... Nothing here by the red one. Here's some bananas. Uh, no, opponent's loyalty. <laughs> uh, 12 hours is not the same as normal Zelda streams. 8 a.m. Eastern is the same start time. So... So there is that. Uh, we did put it to a vote in Discord. 
and the majority of the people in Discord voted for the same start time. We had three options at 8 a.m., 2 p.m., and 8 p.m. for the start. Um, if it takes less than 12 hours of the sword, I will be surprised. Uh, <laughs> but if it takes less than the 12 hours, I don't know. We'll probably go back to more Korok hunting. We're still trying to 100% the stream after all. Uh, we'll at least have the, the benefit of the Master Sword being all the way powered up. Wait, what can we take over here? A Nacorn. Cool. Still not getting any Korok vibes. Oh, I definitely agree, guys. If, if you got to get an animal, um, finding your local shelter is always the best. But before you decide to get an animal, I always recommend, always recommend doing a, uh, a search on the internet for proper care of said animal breed and think about it for a while. And kind of, wow, these, uh, these guys are getting pretty sneaky. That's how we got the electrified treasure off to rock. I think that's a better picture. But absolutely, look, make sure you're you're gonna be able to get the eighth floor epic fell. I yeah, I I watched a guy um, play it for like five hours, and and he still hadn't beaten it. He got all the way up to like the final room, according to everybody. Oh, it's Kilton! Hey guys, it's time for a little bit of a shiny squirrel moment. We're going over to Kilton to see what we can get out of him. We're going to just briefly double check over here this purple pin. And this this poor Lizalfa that's about to have a really bad day. Barbecue Lizalfo. He's about to be donationed to, to Kilton. We've officially spooked every single horse. Wow. Uh, yeah, potato chip. A big potato chip. Uh, that's who I was watching. Ah, uh, Yagnash, this is... Dude, this is 100% completion. I, I, I'm... Yagnash, I appreciate everything you've done, man, but I gotta tell ya, you, you've been here long enough to where you know what the stream's about. Yeah, uh, absolutely, uh, Jerry. I I had a I had three guinea pigs, and guinea pigs. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I have seven mons, so it's time to do some mon exchange, guys. And people uh, people don't understand, and that certain animals are more than what the people at the PetSmart want to tell you about, and that's. That's what I found with guinea pigs, and I, I love my guinea pigs. They're great. Um, I, I had one that we lost, unfortunately, due to a respiratory infection, and it's just uh, uh, no. I don't have two parts of Dark Link at the moment. Opponent's loyalty. I don't have any Dark Link. I don't think. So we'll we'll be uh, exchanging all the Bacoblin stuff and the Zolfo stuff for Mon. The the heavier hitter stuff and the Keys parts. We'll we'll be changing out Keys parts also. And we'll see what we can get after all that's done. Oh, okay, kill him. That's cool. Hmm. That's a problem. Uh, yeah, we, 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 we have conversations. Um, they're not always about the game. Sell Moldago Guts? Um, well, they, they were adorable. Uh, we moved to Atlanta, Georgia from Oklahoma City. And it just was not a an actual a trip that we felt that they were going to be able to survive the move. Uh, so we actually had guinea pigs and cats, um, but we traded them for wild rabbits, squirrels, and birds. So we we kind of get that. Keep the tails. We might need them later on. Uh, okay, okay. The electric tails especially. All right. The moblin guts will sell off. Hmm. Good morning. 
morning, Mobile Gamer. How's it going, man? We are doing Breakfast of the Wild until 1040 today, so we still got about an hour and, what, 12 minutes? Something like that, guys? So we'll uh, we'll sell the Lizophilus horns, uh, Lizophilus talons, but the tails will keep per Matt's suggestion. All right, wow, we're getting we're getting a pretty good amount of mon. All right, uh, Lionel stuff we're not going to sell. Choo Choo stuff we will sell. Okay. All right. The uh, Moldaka stuff, guys. Do I need that for upgrades? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yagnesh, man, we're 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 not selling the stuff we need for upgrades. <laughs> and and we, we we mentioned that too, dude. Yagnesh, um, take a take a moment, man. Side balls will sell. On a one to ten, how cute are Koroks? I'm Korok man. Koroks are about a nine on the cuteness scale. Don't sell the ancient pieces, yeah. Uh, we might uh, we might do a shiny squirrel moment in the next little bit, guys, and go to the Akala lab so we get an idea of what we can get ancient pieces wise because we got quite a bit of that. Uh, all right, so keeping the Moldago stuff, keeping all that. All right, cool. So now we want to spend some on. Come on, come on. Uh, well, thanks, Kellen. Appreciate that. All right, wooden mop. I don't think we need the spring loaded. <laughs> I don't think we need uh, Lionel mask. We already have. We already have all the masks. We don't have the monster stuff. Um, I guess we just go for the dark set. Sell nine fins. I should have enough. Okay. Sounds good. The spring loaded hammer is only good to add to the compendium. Okay. So we're going to sell nine fins. the rest of that set anything else we can sell guys wear that costume around NPCs uh, probably will what about regular Lizophos tells those aren't elemental based I and mean, there's all of them let's see if that'll get us the I think oh we're so close we're so close Anything else we can sell? Only 15 cores for upgrades of the ancient core variety. Um, oh, good luck, Derpy. Good luck. So let's just sell five of these, which will get us the the rest of the mon we need. Oh, wow. Actually, bad math, Mag. Okay. <laughs> Uh, Octorok stuff is super cheap, though. Like, they sell for one mon each. There's there's no reason to sell them. Number one, and number two, they're super easy. Oh, cool. Awesome, Mobile Gamer. We're, we're doing that tomorrow. We are taking on the Trial of the Sword tomorrow. We are going to do our best. Uh, two would have done it, two might have done it. But we got a little extra spending mon for later. Okay, so now we go back to what we were doing. Pull up that wonderful little map we have. So I th think... I 
it would almost seem to indicate that somewhere around here... Oh, no, not that button again. Not that button again. Okay. Somewhere around here, we might have some kind of Korok in trouble. Kind of feel like Doctor Who with the Korok mask, you know, with the, the psychic paper given to the stress signal. Just kind of shakes and tells you you got stuff going on, and boom, there it is. <laughs> If you fail, you'll follow me. Hey, man, that's that's a uh, you know that's that's the thing, man. If, if if you don't succeed at it first, just keep trying at it. I mean, I've been trying to beat this game for 54, 55 streams, and uh, you know I haven't succeeded at it quite yet. But hey, it is what it is. Oh yeah, big Doctor Who fan over here too, man. Yeah, that horse is still kind of freaking out. Uh, Fox T, got to ask, who's your favorite classic Doctor and who's your favorite Neo Doctor? All of them, mobile gamer. True 100% completion, man. Korok on small rock south of you in the sea. It's a seaweed circle. Okay, that's good to know. We will be doing a 180 as soon as we have explored just this little stretch of beach. Making sure we haven't had any Koroks in distress. Alicia Hopkins, I uh, I try to be entertaining, you know. And the, one of my best ways to entertain people, in my opinion, is through humor. So yeah, absolutely being funny. Uh, there is one on the edge of where you're headed. It's not that great due to high durability. Yeah, that's that's what I've heard about all the royal stuff. Is that the royal stuff is good to look at, but it ain't really good to use. All right. Hello, Korok, are you there? Nope, that's a frog. What about over here, Korok? Are you here? You're here, Korok! Yay! We found him! We got the seed! And... Looks like we got us a snail. A Korok, a seed, a snail, an ancient relic. We're doing really good. Dude, don't lose your head. <laughs> now he lost it. Now my horse is spooked because skeletal pieces on horses just don't mix. Alright. We don't have any need to pick up their arms, so we're good there. Um, yes, yeah, Mesh. I used the pro controller. I've. Yeah. That's what I've heard. Uh, Jerry, thanks for the subscription, man. I don't know how you got this in your recommended, but I'm awesome. Hey, I'm, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate it. I uh, I don't know how I get recommended to people either. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's, you know, the standard stuff, like, share, comment, subscribing, and that not-so-standard stuff, the smoke signals. All you guys have been sending out them smoke signals. It's working. We're getting people like Jerry coming in here off of those. So there we go. Uh, should have kicked the head. Well, the water was too shallow. If you kick the heads into the water, they'll drown. Uh, two more along that stretch of land. Um, okay. So I'm going to have to go back. Alright, it is raining. Korax man. It's one of my natural weaknesses is the rain. All right. Oh, it's foggy. Ugh. All right. So I was told that there was Korok 
Like, probably here. Or here. And knowing the way the game likes to try to kill me, here sounds like a good possibility also. YouTube guided me to you from For Honor stream while I was watching. Whoa! Um, that's really odd. <laughs> For Honor and uh, Zelda have very little to do. This is the only English YouTube stream of Breath of the Wild. Glad, though, enjoying it. Okay. Well, I'll, I'll accept that. Um... Silly Lazophos. How about you come over here and say that to me? Huh? Huh? What? I can't lift them up like I do everything else? That's that's sad. Alright. Oh, and of course we're Volley's Gal. Volley's Gal's not up either. Uh, too much rain, yeah. Rain is rain is definitely one of those mechanics that I kind of get why they did it. Apparently, it's not wet enough outside to. Uh... All right, if you guys won't fight me where I want to fight, then I'll come over here and fight you on your little base. Have any voltage stuff? Yeah, I do. Oh, I know I got these two. Rivali's Gale is now ready. Rip. I <laughs> wasn't expecting to blow myself up on that. Um, yeah, I've seen that part of the trial. It was not good. I'm, I'm not looking forward to the Lizalfos fight in the trials. It looks like we managed to kill a couple of them. So you can pick them back up yet? Alright. Dead Lizalfos. Yeah, I've... Yeah, it... Master Trial is, uh... Sword Trial is gonna be really rough. That's why I gave myself 12 hours. Alright. These bombs over in the trials... Uh, yeah... Yeah, I've seen that too. Um, that was karma for hurting poor little Lizalfos. Yeah, I, I kind of took advantage of a couple of the lizard, lizard dudes that were just minding their own business. All right. <laughs> to the next little rock island. Hopefully we'll find a Korok here somewhere. Nope, no Korok over here. Alright, so that means the last little rocks that were south of the beach are over this way. Uh, they are absolutely a legit tactic. They're absolutely... Let's see here. Da -da -da. <laughs> Trials in Master Mode. Oh, Pona's loyalty, you are... You're legit crazy. Hey, it's a swimming hole one. And we'll just drop right in, say hi to the Korok. Hi, Korok! Yeah. 
Uh, it's a bit more than that. They get the health regen, too. All the monsters in Master Mode get health regen. And they get up DPS and up uh, health points. <laughs> oh, Ashing. LA. Welcome to the stream. Um, yeah, I can open up my map. One second. Let me open up and zoom and get a real quick snack bite. So right there, Matt, and uh, Demon. It's in the bend of the stretch of land. Uh, you're lucky you finish all the shrines because you can't use any of your powers. Okay. Did I tell you about the stream where we spent roughly an hour helping the guy locate the last seven or so seeds? No bonus loyalty, but I'm looking forward to that for us. Uh, granted, I'm going to do that when I start the trials today. Okay. That one's more of a 270 degree, would make more sense. Okay. So... Not there, but like more like there. Alright, let's break out the color box, guys. Are we going to purple? Or green? North of the Korok I just got, so purple. Alright. It's below Gooby Shores, okay. okay. Alright, so we're heading to purple! Alright, more north. Rock man away. And armed with his trusty lawnmower sword. North side of purple. Okay. I realize I just Ed myself? Edited yourself? Yeah. <laughs> See how the piece of land curves. Are we talking like here, maybe? Is that what we're talking about? Having to pause for the delay on the stream, move up. I got a yes, I got a there. And I, I think we're going to go with the yes there because everybody is usually a little, you know, behind. And so, okay, I got so many yeses in the chat right now. And what they said, pointing upwards. Okay, it looks like we got where we got to go. Okay. So even as cool as the Korok mask is, there's definitely some uh, some drawbacks. Oh, and I hear the distress call. Here we go. And we found another Korok. Yeah, -ha -ha! we found him. Awesome. 
All right, bye bye, little Korok. And right, for those of you who are joining in, my name is Mag Synchro. I'm with Convertible Turtle Gaming, and that is a group of myself and my wife Dig Rat. Uh, I play Breath of the Wild every morning at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, unless real life kind of shows up and says not for right now. No Korok there I was just checking. Uh, we also play another of other games. Uh, 23 subs and found a weird glitch in Breath of the Wild. Well, we try not to use glitches, so... Um, cool that you found one. I would report it to Nintendo so they can patch it out. And see what we can do. But yeah, um, we basically stream Breath of the Wild 8 a.m. every day. On Monday evenings, we stream Ark Survival Evolve. Tonight, we're not going to be doing Ark because I'm resting up for the 12-hour Trial of the Master Sword stream that starts tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. Uh, gave it some thought, guys. I understand that Mark fans are going to be a little disappointed. I, I just got to be rested for it, though. Um, we had the votes. I may want to heal. Oh, Mifa's Grace is down. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh, speaking of healing, I may actually want to start cooking again at some point. We, we might do that a little bit toward the end of the stream also. We got another... Looks like 50 minutes on this stream, guys. We're going until 10.40... It's not yet 10 o'clock, so we're, we're doing pretty good. Alright, Korok by Kasketa Shrine, which is the one in the middle of the sea east of me. Um, not that one. Not that one. Well, it would appear that no, we have not. Time to travel! And the, the delay. Uh, the Korok's progress. We're at 116, so we're doing pretty good, man. A white moblin was frozen. Um, okay. Oh, hello. Uh, looks like we got to do this by Korok Leaf. Okay, or no, I, I know how to do this one. And Korok Man gets there. Yeah. 117 Koroks. Uh, the mask makes spooky sounds. Yes, it does. Uh, and it was before DLC. What was before DLC? Da, 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 da. I'm not seeing what you were saying before, Derpy. Uh, wow. Okay. Word glitch before DLC. Okay. Yep. We're getting there, guys. Oh. We, we can't deflect stuff. Oh, we, we got... We got all manner of things wanting to kill us right now. That's usually Korok Man's cue to, uh... Vamoose. Alright. Yep, always in the nick of time when it's the, the timed ones because I'm pretty slow to get there. Alright, 13 shrines left, Noah. 12! That's cool. That's way cool. I, uh, I've got just the one in Hyrule Castle left. Alright, so we got this Korok Seed. Kinda looks like there should be one, like, around here somewhere. So let's just fast travel there. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. Time to warp out. I know, Mobile. My OCD is kinda getting to me too, but... We, we gotta save that one for the big, huge Hyrule Castle stream, so... Vivali's Gale is now ready. Heh, <laughs> that's funny, Pizza. Alrighty. So hopefully... We didn't come here for nothing. Nothing. 
Catano Bay has one. Well, I don't know where Catano Bay really is, so... There's, there's a lot of them just about everywhere, though. Hopefully we'll find one out here, kind of exploring, because this looks like it's open and has none of them. I never did that shrine where you're at. It's uh, it's not bad. You gotta find some pieces of stuff. Like, there's a piece here, um, a couple other pieces, and then you gotta, like, sit down. I'm there. Okay, I'm at Catano Bay. Okay. Yeah, United States Geography I'm okay with. Uh, High Roll Geography I'm not so much. One well, just a bit north of Muo Jim Shrine near me. Okay. Is that what that was? Nope. That's not Muo Jim. That's not Muo Jim. That's Muo Jim. So there's one north of there? So if this is Katano Bay. I guess I'll fast travel up here to avoid having to spend 20 minutes walking up the cliff. Just a bit north. Yeah, opponent's loyalty. It was all the way on one side of the water. Ah, I do have the forest dweller items, man. Like, the spear I've been using a lot. Um, the shield not so much, because the shield's not as useful. I've been using a wooden shield, though. And a rusty shield. And hey, it already just chimed. Okay. Well, Matt said just a bit north, so we're going to go just a bit north. Let's see if we can't figure out what we need. Look for things that are super out of place with stasis. Hmm. It is between a rock and a hard place. <laughs> Well, yeah, Yagnesh, I have those all on the display in my house, man. Looks like it wasn't down here like I was hoping, so back to climbing up like Korok Man does sometimes. Maybe check the small ledges. Use Force Wall of Spear and Court I I'm using the weapons that best suit the par purposes right now, Yagnash. Korok Man doesn't have to use just one weapon, but he keeps his secret identity a secret using his trusty suit that he's got. Um, yeah, opponent's loyalty. I'm looking forward to the 12-hour stream. I'm, I'm really looking forward to the actual the actual uh, Master Sword trial. Um, not 100% true, Derpy. The Majora's Mask doesn't work as well for Lionels, from what I understand. And pers I use the Lionel mask more than the other monster masks. That looks suspicious. And the eggs look delicious. So we're going to go over there and see what we can get. Looks like there's a rock. That That's always really in the give of, of a, a core rock. It's a rock.
And nope. Not what we were hoping for. Okay. Yes, I was aware of the hard boiled eggs. Alright, Korok Man is going to borrow some other clothes real quick. Up. Oh. And hopefully we'll be able to get to the other side quickly enough. We really need to upgrade this this climbing there. Hey Pro Gaming, welcome back. Korok Man is going to destroy you. Oh, Link Hero of the Time, man. Korok Man is he is not violent, he's not aggressive. Unless you're a Korok, then he might drop a rock on you by accident. Cammy, good morning. Uh, walk to the tip of that mountain. Okay. Let's see if we can get up the mountain first. If you go super person to nap because you can, if you look at the weird rock ships that were some of the... Um, sorry, my, my brain didn't process all that really well, pro gamer. Or pro gaming. Um, oh, it looks like there's a rock right here. Maybe we just lucked right onto it. Now climb up. Yeah, I, I absolutely. Getting the... Hey, unknown lost souls. 3 p.m. for you. Well, it, it's still morning for me, so I, I say good morning. Sunsets and sunrises are gorgeous in this game. Yes, they are. That's okay, pro gaming. No, no problem with that at all, man. I uh, I say things wrong all the time. Alrighty. So we got that. Okay, so... Is there one over here that I needed to worry about, guys? I'll leave that up for a second just so you guys can get a look at it. Any Korok seeds nearby here, guys? About 20 feet back from that one. Like, still on the cliff wall, or...? Um, yeah, Yagnesh, today's Monday. There's one at the cove, move up. It's a pretty fun game, Lost Souls. A tip for the sword trials is that you can bring buffs to the trials. Yeah, I've heard that by a few people. It sounds kind of, uh... Alright. Go to the U-shaped pond west of me. Well, that's kind of U-shaped. That looks like it's kind of got a U in it, too. Gamma Cove. Alright, so that looks like probably where we're heading at the moment. Is there any others that you guys are seeing while I got the, the, the map out? Huntress, you seen any? Matt, any others? Uh, we're trying not to expand out. We're, we're trying to go to the ones that are closest to us at the moment. We'll expand out when we get there, though. Expanding out also doesn't give us the luxury of knowing which Korok seeds we've gotten. Directly north of the Kaya Shrine. Directly north. So I'm guessing, like, down there. Or down there. All right, near the shore. So more like purple then, Matt, you'd say? One on top of Mount Dunset. I don't see Mount Dunset. 
Oh, over there's Mount Dunset. Okay. So I, I think what we'll do is we're going to go for this one right here. And then we're going to fast travel here so we can get this. And then get that one, guys. I'm doing good, Hunter Prince. More. Oh, uh, okay, Matt. Um, my apologies. I was not aware. I'll try to use some more uh, different ways to go about it. Uh, where I placed the green stamp. Um, there's a rock circle. So, like, right there. Oh, that is like a rock circle. Okay. So, we'll put that green. We'll go to the blue, because he said at the shore. And we'll make sure there's not one there. And then we'll actually... Course correction. Since we're right here. Not that. This. There's the rock. So, two look yellow, two look blue, and one is red. So, we will just use the blue one, the yellow one, and the red one from here on out. And that'll just be easier for everybody. Because we definitely don't want to exclude anybody. And color blindness is a real thing. I've actually got a relative who's colorblind. And so, I, I know how frustrating it is for him. Uh, there's certain games we just don't play, uh, for certain. Uh, Dr. Mario is one of them. Dr. Mario is not his favorite game at all. Uh, hey, Splat Bros. Welcome to the stream, man. There isn't one at the shore. I'm staring at the guide map now. Okay, you subscribe pro gaming. Appreciate the subscription. So let's get rid of that blue dot, because it ain't going to do us any favors. And that's not going to port us up like we wanted to. We should have dropped our travel medallion before we went down. Oh, well. Yeah, it is what it is. We're going to start climbing up. Hey, Deathstro Kid. Welcome back to the stream, man. Always glad to see somebody coming back. It's more entertaining for me than anything. It's a good conversation starter. Yeah, that's cool. That's a positive way to look at it, Matt. My, my uh, wife, Digrat, she thinks I'm colorblind sometimes based upon my attire choices. I, I have a habit of confusing colors like yellow and orange and green and blue and purple and... Uh, Pretty much anything that's not white or black. Especially when you put things next to each other. Uh, I'm notorious for wearing dark blue and black shirts. But she's always looking out for me, so she, she makes sure that I've got... Oh, we're about to fall. We're about to fall. Splat. Okay. Time for the Korok flight. And we fly like a Korok. There we go. And... I think we're going to go toward the yellow one. And we're going to activate the Korok Stealth Maneuver, known as Bokoblin Infiltration. Ah, I found a doggy, that's awesome. They make glasses for that? Yeah, I've heard that. I've heard that. They're, they, uh, they've made some really good, really good strides and stuff. And it was kind of upsetting. My, my cousin actually wanted to go into the Air Force. And he wound up failing the colorblind test. Was, that's how he found out he was colorblind. Kind of like that guy on Little Miss Sunshine. And found out that he wasn't going to be able to fly a plane, but he was eligible to be in the Navy. So he actually went in the Navy and did two tours. Um, which was really awesome because he got some really cool stuff from Japan when he was stationed over there. Uh, really awesome Japanese PlayStation. It's also where you found Magic the Gathering cards of all places was over in Japan. That's where I learned how to play Magic the Gathering just because of that. Yeah, they only pay attention to your head. But goblins are not the smartest. Um, they're they're kind of like goblins in any other game. Korok Man is here to save you. Stop running, little Korok. Stop running, little Korok. Yeah, ha, ha we found you. You're safe now. Alright, in 
And now we're going to go over here to this yellow pin and hopefully make it magically disappear. And to the purple. Hey! 60 likes. Oh, wow. Hey, Laura, welcome back to the stream. Follow the leader. Oh, you guys didn't follow close enough. I'm sorry. A Lionel saw through your Majora's mask. Yeah, they will. Lionels will see through the Majora mask. They, uh, Majora's mask is not the be all end all. They will see through the Lionel mask. So according to a couple people, they actually see through Majora's mask faster than the Lionel mask. All right. Uh, Lionel saw. The, yeah, it, it it takes him a bit. But I I saw someone who was. Oh, this looks nice. This is gonna let us do some hardcore farming for some rock pieces. Um, we might actually lose our boulder smasher here. Because there's so much flint, sapphires, emeralds, topazes. Uh, this gets a stamp. This absolutely gets a stamp of the gemstone variety. Yeah, Lionels hate cameras. Lionels, uh... I think Lionels hate anybody who's not native to Hyrule, and I believe they view themselves as the natives. I forget who had mentioned it, but apparently Lionels are the only monster in the game that wasn't created by Ganon. Can you show us that location in Zoomed Out? Yeah. Zoomed Out all the way for you guys. I remember when you got your mod ship. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Uh, modded on Juice's channel yesterday. That's cool. Yeah, I'm familiar with Juice Box. He, uh, he plays with his uh, girlfriend, if I remember right. Yep. Alright, let's see if we can get this one. Alright, we're going to have to do this the... Not that way. Okay, guys. Alright. <laughs> I was... I was pretty certain that that was going to blow up in my face, quite literally. Um, but yeah. Well, there's an easy way to go tell that, Derpy. If you'll go to Google and just type in what is my time zone, it'll find it for you. On the map above Mount Dunsit, Dunsil Plateau is Kea Pond. Okay. Kea Pond. Here we go. We are going to stamp that. We are going to fast travel to Tawajin, because that looks like it's going to be kind of close. Ah, uh, Splat Bros. I, I don't know, man. <laughs> I, I know I've got 119 shrines beaten. I got all the bosses beaten, except for Ganon. I got 121 Koroks. So... Comprise whatever percentage you can think of, if you, if you will, on that. Uh, how many Koroks did I get where he's gone? Roblox Gamer up to 121. How many where I was when you left? I don't remember. But that's how many I got was 121 minus that number. South of Kea Pond, another one northeast of it. You may need to flower the trail. This one is a flower trail. Okay. Oh. Wait, what? Okay, this is the... Okay. Alright, so the northeast of it is probably this one, I would say. And the one south of it, we probably don't have. There is one flower trail. It's hard, but we'll get through it. Yes, we will press on. We will endure. 
try to do a pun. <laughs> Sometimes puns are difficult, you know? Puns get a lot of flack for being just really corny jokes. Um, a derpy shark? Yeah, there's a lot of people that can help me get that last shrine. But that last shrine's in Hyrule Castle. And Hyrule Castle won't be started until the end of the stream system. So when the stream series is getting there, we will uh, border the pond. It's at the end of the pond. Alright. Alright, cool aura. You just want to do a speed test, actually. Uh, if you got about 5 meg up, you should be able to stream. It may not be the, the best quality, though. <laughs> you can get punished for using puns. Maybe other places, but we don't have a penitentiary here for the convertible turtle club. You yeah. Usually, if you if you got the if you got the pun chops, and you're usually turtly enough for the turtle club. All right, so here we come to this pond. I know you would dig rat. Dig rat is uh, dig rat's my my better half and she is not a fan of the puns so being my better half one would say that puns are definitely not part of being the better half <laughs> uh, let's see here it's pun believable oh I wish the item from all the Korok seeds well you get the uh... <laughs> oh let's see here See what's going on here. All right, give me just a second, guys. Uh, see that the green screen's moving a bit. I'm gonna have to fix it. Guys, we'll, we'll just we'll just deal with it the way it is on the on the left hand side or the right hand side, whichever side you're looking at. Mifa's grace loaded up. Cool. So walk straight ahead. You can see the first flower. Let's see here. Head Sue's. Okay, look for a flower. All right, we're looking for a flower. Maybe it's one that we can stasis find? Oh, is it one of these flowers? Oh, well, that's not too bad. These flower puzzles are pretty fun, actually. can't see it. My head's actually moved into it. See, it's over here. It actually was a lot bigger. See the little tear right there? That tear was actually over the whole entire right-hand side. Okay, it wait, it gets challenging. Well, did they show up in the... There it is, it's on the rock. Okay. Oh, 
Flower is playing hide and go seek with me, guys. Where is it at? Over here. Thirty of them. All right, guys. Okay. Yeah, uh, we're we're doing it totally guide free. It's all through you guys. Yeah, I know, guys. We'll, 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 I'll worry about it off camera. All right. So is we had one over here. Where's the? Squid's GG switch. Hey, man. Now go to the hill to the northeast corner of the pond. Not the, the three trees. Not the three trees. Okay. So this is the pond. Not the three trees. Are we talking like right over here where the, uh, the blue pin is? One near small plateau northeast of you, very close. Uh, maybe where the red pin is? On that hill there. Well, the stream's delayed journey, so that's why we try to use the, the color markers. Um, is it in between red and blue, guys? Near the red pin. All right, so we're going to go to the red pin. To the red pin, Korok Man goes. Huh? Have I done a what, RC? Uh, no, I've got one in Hyrule Castle left, but Hyrule Castle is the last of the stream series. Oh, cool, Squid. I'm, uh, I'm very happy with my Switch. I've had it since April. Alright, look for something weird. Because there's always weird stuff involving these Koroks. There's... Well, we're not looking for that one at the moment, Demon Huntress. But appreciate you putting that out there. Is there still stock issues? Oh, yes. They are... They are really hard to find in the United States. Uh, no, I don't have arms, man. I, I'm not one of those people that buy games just to have games. I... Oh. There's a whole entire underside over here. I'll uh, I'll buy a game through the Free For All Wednesdays. If you guys are wanting to play a game with me, highest donor gets to choose the game. Uh, right now, that's Shadow. So, Shadow's got the choice of whatever he wants to play with me on Wednesday. Uh, Mobile Gamer... Usually gets second place uh, or first place. He actually got first place the last two times, and he chose Mario Kart 8, which was a blast. And he chose PUBG. Um, is what a DLC pack? The the mask I have is a DLC pack, and the costume I have is a DLC pack. Hey, it's a Korok Rock, probably. Boom. There is a Korok there. Yes. That is what we were looking for. We're looking for all the Koroks. Alright. <laughs> Korok man up, 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 and away. Okay, so... Demon Huntress was telling us outside of Hanu Pond. So here's Hanu Pond. 
So we'll fast travel this way to see if we can go up there. Uh, yes, Derpy, I have all the masks. I have everything from the DLC except for the trial taken care of. Go to Tiny Pond by Stinger Cliffs. After we do the Hanu Pond one, Matt, we will do. Koto Pond. Well, we're looking for Hanu Ponds first. So the one for Hanu Pond. All right, there's Stinger Cliffs. Tiny Pond by Stinger Cliffs. So that's it. Is that the same one that you're mentioning, Demon Huntress, by Hanu Pond? Because, yeah, we'll be looking at Koto Pond later, but Hanu Pond's where we're at right now. That is the Hanupon one. Okay. It's between Stinger Close and Hanupon. So I think we're probably looking at the right place then. All right. Southwest corner Kotopon is where a big tree is. Oh, you're talking about a different pond, man. Yeah, I'm not going to remember any of that probably. Okay. And that is a red Hinox who's just sleeping, minding his own business. We'll let him sleep. We have no reason to wake him up. They sell squids and vending machines here for bait. That's neat. Alright, giant boomerang. Giant boomerang is probably much, much better than Bokoblin Arm. Uh, everything but the one that's inside the castle, man. Uh, it's a circle rock pattern. Okay, well that makes it easy to find. Circle rock patterns are always easy to find. But yeah, we're up to the point where we're Korok hunting, guys. Anything that's not involving Korok hunting, uh, we're pretty much to Hyrule Castles where we gotta be for it. I like robbing the Hynix somewhat too, but doesn't always work. Oh, cool, Nashia Gimmer. Uh, appreciate coming to the stream and all. I'm glad you beat Ganon. Uh, well, there's the question, right? Did you finish Breath of the Wild, or did you just beat Ganon? That doesn't look like a rock puzzle. Well, looks like he died. <laughs> uh... Wow. Whoops. I don't know. They, they sleep about as often as a, a big dude would from a scientific standpoint. That size. You're, uh... Yeah, that was overkill, wasn't it? That was a bomb arrow. Whoops. Okay. <laughs> we wasn't even aware we had them equipped still. Into the water we go. Yeah, we found you, we found you. Alrighty, guys. It is getting close to the time that we need to start doing some other things. Another by the P of the Koto Pond west of me. So, Koto Pond near the P. We're going to put that pin down, and this will be the last Korok seed we find today. Uh, well, Nashi, uh, Tyler's Epic Adventure, welcome. Sarah Comstock, welcome. Welcome to the stream, guys. Uh, Nashi Gamer, uh, yeah, they're they're useful, and I I will definitely keep a lot more, but as you can see, we have 870 rupees, and that's kind of hard to, to buy. Uh, well, what's next? We're going to get this last little Korok seed, and then we're going to go to the Akala Lab and try to see what we can do as far as buying some stuff. And then we're going to go to Hetsu and do the Hetsu dance. There are two in Koto Pond. Oh, now you tell me. A fairy dust trail. Okay, I always like those. A berry fire. No problem there, man. No problem. We, we don't take attendance. You know, we, we say hi to people when they show up. 
We miss them when they're not here, but you know, it's kind of like a family thing. You know, there's there's nothing big. Hello, you. You're coming over for this guy's stick. I know you are. You're trying to find me. Chill out, dude. You'll get your turn. I said chill out. You'll get your turn. Dude just doesn't understand it, guys. I hope he got the picture that time. No, still didn't get the picture. Okay. He's smoldering a bit. I hadn't bought the arrows and armor 50,000 or more. Oh, wow. Yeah, Aqua Lab's supposed to get expensive. Uh, you may want to sell stuff before going to the lab. Well, won't the lab buy stuff from me, though? Can't sell at the lab. Okay, there's a stable not so far off. All right. Well, it seems to suggest that there is some. Um Stuff around here. Not seen any yet. Secret unnamed spring nearby. Okay. Hmm. Oh, uh, Nashi, the reason why we're going to the lab is we're doing 100% the acorn in the middle of that tree. Um, was there an acorn in the middle of this tree? I didn't see one. Hmm. Up, up into the air. Still not seeing it. Ah, oh, yeah, the rain's back. It's chasing the leaves for this one. being here that's going to be a problem oh there is the okay there's the Korok oh my gosh still much rain yeah yeah it's the less sparkly leaf thing that runs around uh, I think this is the one that we were talking about there's a hardy lizard there's some lotus pods Highland Shroom. Now look on the map for the big tree close to that pond. Are we talking about this tree over here? Or this tree over here? Or this tree over here? Are we talking about red, blue, or yellow? Ah, uh, rain is mean. Rain is absolutely mean, Roblox. 
We got a yes. So now we just need a, a red pin. Okay. That's the confirmation we're looking for. Okay, cool beans. If he's still behind me, he definitely ain't happy now. Catch! Catch! He doesn't play catch as well as the Moldogas do. I'm kind of disappointed with the Bokoblin. Alright, this red one here, guys, this is going to be the last one that we do. Uh, they might kick those bombs. Uh, they've not kicked the bombs yet, but I have seen on other streams where they do kick the bombs. Well, this is pretty cool. Oh, it's I'm still tracking apples, guys. What is wrong with me? Um, let's go back to tracking treasure chests. I don't need to know what an apple's nearby. Uh, there was a Korok earlier that we had to dislodge an apple, and it was just the fastest way to find it. All right. Yeah, we're going to do some slipping and sliding here. Oh, we found a place we could park. Oh. Awesome, I love it. Three more close, but yeah, we're heading... Actually, we're not going to be doing the, the lab at this point even. The amount of time we're doing, we're just going to go to Hetsu and call it good, I think. Uh, actually, there's a video that you can beat the game without climbing anywhere. Um, maybe so, Matt. Maybe so. At 34 Koroks. Trail starts at the other end of the tunnel. But this is going to be where we call it at the moment, guys, because it is five minutes until the stream ends. And so we're going to take our travel medallion. We're going to place it here. That way we can fast travel right back here and pick up right where we left off that and go from there. Um, what's Roblox asking? Correct. Yeah, there's no stream this evening, guys, because I got a 12-hour stream tomorrow morning. And, hey, Frankster Gaming and Vlogs, welcome to the stream, man. We are just about to wind down for the day. All right, and where is that forest? Boom, travel. And we got a travel dance going on. Photo of Beetle behind me. It's rare. I need it later. I've already traveled. It's gone. Uh, Centipede Chipmunk just subscribed. That's horrifying sounding. Okay. Stream lag. Yeah, stream lag will uh, stream lag will be the death of me in one of these games, guys. It'll uh, it'll always be one of those things that delays us. Oh, Hetsu! Yeah. Uh, New just subscribed. Hey, New, thanks for the subscription. Uh, it's not just this chat. It's it's every YouTube chat. Um. It's a little bit more expensive than that. Okay, we got... I, I hit the wrong button. So we got 12 for that one. I think the shield stash... Oh, come on. Mag, wake up a little bit more. Shield stash. Uh, Rift Scoff's fans just subscribed. Thanks for the description, man. You love me like sausage. Okay. <laughs> 
Um, oh, time to deliver pizza, man. Oh, thanks for the $5 donation. Really appreciate that. All right, need to, 10 Korok seeds. We can do 10 right there. Everybody hashtag uh, pizza man. Or time to deliver, uh, deliver a pizza ball. That's, that's a lot. But yeah, really appreciate that. And uh, yeah, way cool, guys. All right. And I need to change that Streamlab notification from the zombie, because it's definitely different. Doing the Hetsu dance, doing the Hetsu dance. Da na 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 na. Yeah, we're going to do the bow stash this time. 12 Korok seeds. Okay, and da -da 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 -da. yeah. All right, so we should be able to go to Shield Stash, and it should be twelve again. Just ten? Okay, awesome, awesome. So at least with two Korok seeds. Pop, and there we go. We got the we got the Hetsu dance going on. We got a couple more Shield slots. I mean, look at this. Back in the day, I couldn't find a shield to save my life. And now we have ten of them in two empty slots. Way cool. Way cool. Well, Hetsu, we're done then, man. Yeah, Hetsu be getting it. Hetsu be getting it. He likes the dance. Oh, man. Alrighty. Um, yeah, but we need 900 to finish the stream. So, 441 seeds... Uh, only 10 for the rest of those upgrades. That's great to know, Eric. That's great to know. So now it's time to go back and take our rest. Traveling back home. Korok Man goes back to his home to become mild-mannered Link, champion of Hyrule. And that means we got to get back into our pajama attire, get to our bed, get some rest... Oh, Kellen. Uh, thanks for that. Really appreciate that. Last one for Shield is 15, though. That's that's easy. 15? Guys, we got 15 during this stream. I mean, we actually got 26 during this stream. So right now, we're, we're doing pretty good. I think we're getting like uh, 8 mag sleeps and leak sleeps. Yeah. You guys got it correct. Uh, all right. So no one suspects his true identity. Korok Man goes into the next room and becomes Link Champion Hyrule. Much like Clark Kent, when people ask him if he saw Superman or Korok Man, he always says, no, I must have just missed him. Who suggested the sleep idea? Uh, I think it was Matt. He just thought it was kind of aesthetically pleasing. And I, I agree. It, it's good, because I sleep, I go in. The travel medallion makes it super easy now. Because I can always go right back to where we were on stream instead of having to hoof it back. Um, <laughs> going to bed also. Oh, it's another, it's another Blood Moon nap. <laughs> we'll let the Blood Moon go, guys. Uh, Vic Shadow 10 just subscribed. Thanks for that last minute subscription there, Vic Shadow. Really appreciate it. Well, guys, we we had an awesome stream today. We got 26 Korok seeds, so much good stuff. We got some the dark armor. Uh, you know, we didn't even put the dark armor on, so we're gonna go real quickly and go and become the Dark Link dude for a second, just so you guys can see it all in its awesome glory. And now we're going to go put back on the, the Korok Man outfit, so we'll be ready for next stream. Because it doesn't matter really what we wear uh, tomorrow, because we're going Trial of the Master Sword. So, yeah, uh, see you in Discord, guys. Uh, exclamation Discord, if you want to join. There are some rules you have to agree with. That's just so we keep the, so we keep the, the Discord chat friendly. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., 12 hours stream 
epic hype, Trial of the Master Sword, and I'm going to be working on getting a real death counter, because <laughs> I know we're going to need it tomorrow. So we're going to see what we can do for that. Um, and we'll see what we can... Yeah, it's going to be fun tomorrow, guys. Everyone, thanks for watching. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hashtags out there. Twitter, Facebook. Have everyone share me. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. And I'll see you tomorrow morning for the epic 12-hour stream. Good night, guys. Wave over this way.